All right, here we are. Get ready for another arena. Probably the first run I've done post Christmas, although I haven't really had Christmas yet. We're kind of waiting for family and friends to show up. They couldn't get off early, so we delayed Christmas. But I have some Christmas candy, which I'll be eating, so I'm sorry. It just has to be done. It is good stuff. Let's see what we get. Let's hope Christmas brings us some luck. Druid Pally Priest. Well, my last attempt at a priest did not go so well. And my last attempt at a pally did not go so well. Let's go with the druid. You were right to awaken me. I hope so. Blood Sail Corsair, instantly bad. Bomb Lover's pretty good. Injured Blade Master, not so good with the Druid, but I guess he's kind of okay. We're taking Bomb Lover though. Oh, oh, can't can't say no to the ogre. Oh, okay. Poison Seed's not that great, but I have to choose between Swipe and an ogre. Swipe or an ogre? Oh, I want them both. Um, I am gonna hope. No, no, I. Swipe is so good. Ogre is so good. Oh. I'm gonna hope I get more swipe chances. Because my late game is always what screws me, and I'm getting late game options. Take that iron bark. Hmm. These are almost all entirely bad, but I think the Iron Beak Owl is least bad. Elven Archer, Force Tank Match, Piloted Shredder. I think we go with this one. Power's super good. Druid of the Fang is pretty good. But uh, let's start getting those two drops. Cogmaster. He's sometimes good, but I've only got one mech so far. I think I take Druid of the Fang here. I don't have any beasts yet, though, except for the power of the Wild Panther. Oh, an Iron Beak. Hmm. This could be a really bad card if I don't get some synergy. Tinkertown Technician. Healing Touch, Windfury Harpy. This is actually a decent card, even if you don't get the battle cry. It's a 3-3 three, three for 3. Yeah, we'll take him. Auctioneer, Mech Bearcat, Matter Bomber. I really like this here Matter Bomber. Whenever this minion takes damage, add a spare part cart to your hand. Spare part card. I don't know. One, two, three, four, five late game cards. I could I could afford to take him. I'm gonna take him. Hmm. Frost Elemental or Starfire? I think Starfire. I mean, Frost Elemental's pretty good. This is definitely pretty good. But, um... Yeah, I think Starfire. More helpful to have a couple of fast answers. Acidic Swamp Ooze. Power? Or Yeti? I'm a little shy on the mid-game. Take the Yeti. Oh, I need some beasts, right? Bloodfen. Ah, uh, Innervate. Do I have room for another Iron Bark? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I could handle another Iron Bark. Eight cards is about as much as I want in the end game. But I don't want to get stuck having to pick one later. You know what? Let's go with the Shieldmaster. Hmm. Undertaker? Probably not going to do me a lot of good right now. So, Bomb Lobber. Because I... Venture Co's good. Don't get me wrong, he's good. But I'm starting to get a little heavy and I don't want to be hurting because I got too many big cards. There's a swipe. Um, Anodized Robo Cub is okay. I mean, he's, he's either a 3-2 or a 2-3. He's, he's almost never bad. 
my problem is that I don't have any three drops, really. Hmm. Although, having an early mech will help out the Tinkertown technician. So I'll take him. Another mech bear cat. Cobra. Definitely taking Cobra. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's like, do I want a Cobalt Geomancer? Like, these two cards aren't really great. And this one isn't very good either. And I don't have any buffs. I don't have anything that would, like, make this guy amazing. Although, with a couple of spare parts, being able to stealth him, the turn I summon him, could be kind of nice. It'd be better than these. Yeah, I'll take him. He's a three. He smooths out the curve a little. Definitely taking that swipe. Soul of the Forest. Well, these two cards aren't great. This can sometimes be really good. Especially with cards like the Piloted Shredder. But unfortunately, I don't have very many of those. Eh. These are all iffy at best. I'll take Soul of the Forest. No, I don't want Naturalized. Stop offering it. Mechanical Yeti? Archmage? I've got a little room for some more heavy cards, but I think Yeti's best here. Um, Knife Juggler? Or Argent Commander? Knife Juggler could be good with Soul of the Forest, but not much else. Hmm, Ancient Watcher. I've only got one silence, so I can't see making good use of that. I've got no way to make make it into a taunt. Argent Commander is always good. So is Knife Juggler. I just don't like... I don't like the idea of having too much late game. I've only got six more choices to make. And I'd kind of like some fives, if I could get them. So, Knife Juggler. A real Yeti. There's a Spectral Knight, but is he better than these? Probably not. How many fours do we have? That's not really a four. Those aren't really fours. So that's two, three, four. We really only have four turn four cards. I mean, it'd be pretty extreme to need to swipe on turn four. So I should take the Yeti here. This is These cards are good. There's no doubt about it. I even said I wanted fives. But the Yeti is a really strong card, and that would put three four fives for four mana in my deck. Hmm. Claw can be really helpful. But I feel like... Oh, well, I don't know. I've already got one Innervate. Would a second one really be that helpful? If I get more big cards, that, that answer would be yes. I've already got four drops. Getting an early Yeti is pretty awesome. Yeah, Innervate. Druid of the Fang. He's a five drop. But what do I got for beasts? Seriously. I, I haven't got any Druid of the Claws. I've got... One Bloodfin Raptor, one Emperor Cobra, and I think that's it. Everything else is a mech. Oh, and the Iron Beak Owl, and Power of the Wild. I guess I have a few options. Yeah, we'll take him. It might be difficult to use him, but we'll take him. Um. Well, Harvest Golem's pretty solid. Ugh. Tree of Life. Restore all characters to full health. This card worries me. Because priests can kill you with it if they steal it and have Akanai Soul Priest on the field. This card... I have no idea if it's any good. Plus five, plus five, and taunt is really big. 
I mean, you could turn a creature into a monster. Five Wisps? Five Wisps could be really good with Soul of the Forest. That's a 10 mana combo, though. Do I take it for a 10 mana combo? Uh, plus five, plus five. Could let me take out a nasty legendary like a rag, though. I've got two innervates. All right, I'm going to take it. Well, there's that deck. How do I feel about it? I don't know. I think the curve is okay. I've got decent late game, which I haven't had for a while. Especially if I can pop these, make them 7-7s seven instead of 4-4s. Four that would be amazing. I've got two swipes. Uh, claw, right? Did I take a claw? I did not take the claw. I must have taken an innervate or something? I can't remember now. So I've got two swipes, a starfire, and the bomb lobber, which is, these kind of all count as some removal. Um, the minions seem pretty solid, though, overall. I mean, Thrallmar Farseer is not great. Iron Beak Owl is pretty much just a silence, but everything else kind of fits where you want them to be. Two mana three twos, four mana four fives, a four mana get an extra card, get an extra minion, uh, decent taunts, and some big guys at the end. Eh, I think we got a good shot. Hopefully we will see something like five or six wins out of this. I don't know. But I'll see you guys in the next fight, in the first fight, uh, well, which will be very soon. Bye-bye.